long. So let him go. Let him go with your right hand. Good. Close both legs and lean back. So already he's doing your horse's bad habit. Do you feel that? So that's something. We're sitting crooked somewhere. That's right. Put your right shoulder back and put your right leg back. Good. Flop in your left hand. So go all the way out to the fence. Put your legs long. Yeah, don't grip them. Let them reach down long. Keep your right shoulder back. Good, do a circle right there with an open left rein, but right shoulder stays back. Open the left. Close your thighs on him. Grab your strap. Close your thighs on him, hands lower, lower. Lean back and sit heavy. Sit on him all the way, that's right, hands low. Close your knees. Good, good. Good, use your inside leg and press him out. Close your left knee. Good, sit still. So right now with your seat and the walk and the trot, you're trying to adapt to whatever he's doing. Don't do that. Make your seat, yeah, make your seat just trot in one rhythm. Good, and then you do a circle somewhere else. Keep that one rhythm with your seat, no matter what he does. Good, let him let his let his neck out a bit. Close your knees hard and then soften, but keep your seat going the same. Good, give your hand. Give one, give the other. Left knee, open the left rein so he. Put your right hand down by the saddle. We want him to connect to the right hand so it can't be too strong. Good. Close your legs. Good. Hold your outside rein too. There you go. Left knee, right rein. Good. And then soften. Let his neck out. Let his neck out. Way longer reins. Yep. Lean back and sit still in the saddle. Good, longer reins. Let your, your reins out really far. Just trust him a little bit. Close your knees. He goes fast, you close your knees and hold. Yeah, and then relax, he did it. And then let your reins out. Good. Find your pose. Longer range. That's right, let his neck out. Close your knees, knees. And the harder we come out of the saddle when you pose. That's right, let his neck out. Give. I can't put my leg on him now. Like, You're fine. upper leg. That's, that's all he is right now. Oh, okay. Let your reins out. Give every other step. Uh, give. Yep. Close your knees. Because when you give, he goes faster, right? you got to give every step up. Give, give, yeah, give, give. Use your knees to control your speed, not your reins. Give, yeah. Okay. There you go. Okay. Put your reins out a little longer. Just use your knees. A little downhill here, a little thighs, knees. Give, give. He did it. Good boy. Okay. There you go. Now you're getting it. Let him out. Good. Give. Yep. Much better with your feet. Yeah, and then give. He did it. Oh, you this is my bad way. Yeah. <laughs> it's his better way, actually. Okay. Hey! How's it going? Good. Left hand low. Good. Good. Let his nose out. So do a circle somewhere else and go back behind us. Keep that same rhythm. Give, give. Much better. Keep your inside hand open, your outside hand low and steady. Right hand more open. 
Left hand lower. Hands haven't moved. Right hand open. Yes. Left, left hand lower. Yes, there you go. Keep that. Open the right. Left hand down by the breastplate. Yep, if you need to make an adjustment, open your right hand wider. But keep the left hand still. Good, right knee. Good, let his left hand, let him reach forward. Low with your left hand. Yeah, think about when you're giving that left hand, it's got to go down to his mouth. Good. Use your thighs. Don't let him lean on your left leg. Yeah, you can use your legs as long as your hands soften and show him that reaching and stretching forward is the answer. We can't block each side and then block the mouth and expect him to find it, right? And you can block one rein, like if he's leaning on the left, block the left rein, but give the right rein and show him. Good, give, give. Steady but quiet. Yeah, very subtle, but on. You're scared.